It's time for lunch with the Bubble Guppies. But first, let us solve this puzzle. This guppy has yellow hair and a whole lot of personality. Fabulous! It's Dima, swim Now, what can I get you today? I'd like a small cone, please. Small, huh? That's three hexagons. I need your help to pick the right machine. Which honeycomb just has three hexagons filled with honey? This one or this one? That one! That's right! This machine has one, two, three hexagons filled with honey. It's honey time! Honey, 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 honey! Here you go! One small honey froyo. Thank you. Be you later. <laughs> Let's solve another puzzle. Come on. This guppy always has Bubble Puppy by his side. Check it out. Perfect. It's Gil. Uh-oh. The alarm. That means the ice cream is starting to melt. It's too hot out here. We need to cool down. Well, you've certainly come to the right place. On really hot days like this, find some shade. Shade happens when an object blocks the sun. It's cooler in the shade than it is in the sunlight. Look at all that shade, Gilly. We just need to find a spot big enough to park the truck in. We need your help. We need to find a shady spot so we can cool down our truck. Which shady spot is the largest? This one, this one, or this one? That one, right there. That's it. Our whole truck is in the shade. Thanks for your help. Ready for a new puzzle? This outgoing guppy is full of imagination. Hello. Excellent, it's Gobi. <laughs> no, please don't make our fruit run. Don't ruin our right produce. <laughs> Your what produce? Ripe. Ripe. Here, try some. That's... that's... so delicious. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh, oh, what have I done? I don't want to make things rotten anymore. I want to make rotten things ripe. You can help us grow more fruits and vegetables, if you want to. Yes! And so, Rotten Tomato and the Space Farmers became friends. And together, they grew the best produce in the galaxy. Time for another round. This guppy wears glasses and really knows his facts. Hmm. It's Nani. You did a great job. What time is it? It's time for lunch. What time is it? It's time for lunch. What time is it? It's time for lunch. It's lunch time. Hey, lunch for lunch. Hey, Molly. What did you get for lunch today? I got a chicken sandwich and some popcorn. What did you get, Una? I got a veggie sandwich and popcorn, too. What did you get, Nani? I got a cheese sandwich and... popcorn? Hey, come back here, popcorn. Time fries when you're having fun. This kind-hearted guppy wears a starfish in her hair. Oh, goody! Very good, it's Una. Right amount of each of our ingredients. It's time to make some yummy pancakes. <laughs> <laughs> yummy! The kitchen witch! Please don't eat us. <laughs> eat you? I don't want to eat you. I just want to help you make some yummy pancakes. <laughs> After all, it's important to have a grown-up in the kitchen. She's going to help us make the pancakes. You bet your sweet syrup I will. 
So the Vikings and the Kitchen Witch made pancakes together. Here come the pancakes! Catch them while they're hot! Flip it up, flip it back, flip it on the pancake stack. And they all lived happily ever after. Oops, sorry about that nonny cakes. <laughs> Ready, splash, blast off! Which intergalactic guppy will appear when we line these tiles up? He's a quiet guppy, and he's very smart. Out of this world, it's Nani. Mission accomplished. I still can't control it. Everyone, keep cleaning. We'll be able to control the ship when the trash levels are down to normal. We're at five, and normal is one. We need your help. Count down with me starting at five. Ready? Five. five. Four, three, two, one. The trashometer is now at one. Thanks for your help. I've got control of the ship. Let's play again. This guppy always sticks up for her friends and asks a lot of questions. Fantastic! It's Una! Oh, Earth is such a beautiful planet. There are three planets that are closer to the sun to choose from. Venus, Earth, and Mars. We need your help. Which of these three planets do you think we should hide on? Venus? Quick, let's hide on Earth. Sorry. So the aliens went to hide on planet Earth. I think we lost him. Another puzzle. He's got a great imagination and loves telling stories. Fantastic, it's Gobi. Let's go. Uh-oh, we've got all the way to the edge of the solar system. I'm not sure how to get home from here. You mean we're lost? Uh-oh. We're lost? We need your help. Which one is planet Earth? Right there. That's it. That's the Earth. to play again? This guppy is a natural born leader with a great singing voice. Swimsational, it's Molly. I'm a moon scout. You still have your flashlight. Help us find the moon bear. Fold your flashlight out. Ready? Flashlight on. Do you see him? For your help. Excuse me, Moon Bear. May we have our flashlights back, please? <coughs> please let me have our flashlights, Moon Bear. We need them. <coughs> yeah, it's dark. Mm -hmm. Don't you like the dark? <coughs> That's it. The Moon Bear took our flashlights because he's scared of the dark. It's okay to be scared of the dark, Moon Bear. You just need a flashlight of your own. Mm-hmm. You can keep one flashlight, Moon Bear, but you have to share the others with us. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> Let's keep solving. He's a brave guppy with a silly sense of humor. You got it, it's Gil. Super Space, go! Oh. Help, help. What happened? Stuck in space goop. 
<laughs> I am crying. <laughs> Aww. Don't cry, robot. We'll get you out of there. Thank you. And so, the space students helped the robot out of the space scoop. Thank you for helping me, space students. You're welcome, robot. I made a mess. In free play, it's okay to get a little messy. You just have to clean up after yourself. Clean up, clean up, clean up, everybody clean up. So the space students taught the robot how to clean up and they all became really good friends. And everyone lived happily ever after. It's story time with the Bubble Guppies. If we line these tiles up correctly, we'll reveal one of our Bubble Guppy friends. He's a brave guppy with a silly sense of humor. You got it, it's Gil. Swimsational. Here it is. Come on, let's try the next page. I'm Gil. Well, I've been looking all over for you. Look what I found! My library card! Thank you. You're welcome! Mission accomplished. Let's play again. This guppy is really funny and loves to sing and dance. It's Dima! Fabulous! I'm gonna need your help to find Gobi, the book about penguins. Come on! First things first, is a penguin a person, a place, or an animal? An animal! Right, penguins are animals, so the penguin book will be here on the shelf with the animal books. My goodness, there are a lot of animal books here. But what kind of animal is a penguin? A dinosaur? A bird or a fish? A bird! That's right! So the penguin book must be here in the bird section. Let's see, parrots, peacocks, um, aha! Penguins! Here you are, sir! A book about penguins! Another puzzle! This guppy has quite an imagination and loves telling stories. It's Gobi! Hello! Let's start at the beginning of the story. Which of these pictures happens first? That one! Right. Humpty Dumpty sat on the wall. That's the beginning of the story. Which picture happens next? That one! Right. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. That's the middle of the story. So which picture happens at the end of the story? This one! Right, that's the end. All the king's horses and all the king's men couldn't put Humpty together again. But wait, there's more. But Humpty knew just what to do. He fixed his shell with tape and glue. Phew, well that's a relief. Ready to play again? This guppy always sticks up for her friends and asks a lot of questions. Fantastic, it's Una. Oh, goody. Where's the kitty book? Enjoy. Kitties. Kitties. Mm-hmm. Kitties. He wants 
to eat some kitties! Borrow? Who, me? Borrow? Really? You can borrow my books anytime you want. You just gotta bring them back. Thank you! And so, the sailors and the Cyclops became good friends. And he let them borrow his books anytime they liked. Goodbye, Cyclops! Thank you for the bugs! We'll bring them back next week! Let's keep solving! This Gubby Puppy is friendly, loyal, and very brave. It's Bubble Puppy! <gasps> the witch! Uh oh, oh no! Don't worry, everyone. She can't turn anyone into a frog anymore. There's no more mean green bubble potion. Oh, yeah? Well, I still have this. No. <gasps> oh. Bubble, bubble, you're all in trouble. <gasps> Look out! Bubble, bubble. I'm in trouble. Ribbit. Whoa! That was a close one. Ready, splash, go. Let's solve this puzzle. Which Bubble Guppy friend will appear? This guppy is a natural born leader with a great singing voice. Swimsational, it's Molly. Now watch as the day becomes dark. What? <gasps> Wowzers! It's dark! Ah! Ah! Make it light again, Queen Molly! Ah! Please! Again, this guppy always sticks up for her friends and asks a lot of questions. Fantastic! It's Una! Right, who wants to get yelled at first? Wait, we haven't done our magic trick yet. The disappearing ogre trick. Hmm? Abra Kadima! Look inside, please. Play again. He's a quiet guppy, and he's very smart. Whoa, it's Nani. Ah! You looked exactly like the rocks. How'd you do that? I'm a horned lizard, and we use camouflage. Camouflage is a way for animals to hide by looking like what's around them. We need to camouflage ourselves. But how? It looks like your puppy has the right idea. Great idea, boy! Hey! Here's the ice cream truck. Should we leave it here? Take the truck. You heard the boss. Camouflage really worked. Another puzzle. He's a brave guppy with a silly sense of humor. You got it. It's Gil. Whoa. If I was a puppy, I'd love it here. But where's Bubble Puppy? Bubble Puppy! Did you hear that? Hi, puppy. 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 Hi,
<laughs> but where's Bubble Puppy? Bubble Puppy! <laughs> Welcome to the Temple of the Lost Puppy! <laughs> Let's keep solving. This guppy loves animals and knows a lot about them. It's Zuli. <gasps> That's a red colobus monkey. Poor monkey. She looks really cold. It's way too cold for her. We have to do something, Captain. Well, you've certainly come to the right place. Welcome to Dima's BJ Boutique. We have clothing for any kind of weather. We need your help to find the right clothes to warm up the monkey. Which set of clothing will make the monkey feel warm? This one, this one, or this one? That one, right there. The one with the mitten. Right. This clothing will warm up the monkey. Thanks for your help. Oh, here you go. You little monkey. <laughs> this fun-loving guppy loves to dance and help customers in her shop. Hi. It's Dima. Tiger Shark! <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong, sir? Yeah, why are you crying? I just wanted some ice cream too, but you keep going away. We're sorry. We're happy to get you some ice cream. <laughs> and so, the submarine sailors gave the tiger shark some delicious ice cream. One single vanilla fish. Open wide, please. Mamma mia! <laughs> Swim-sational, another puzzle. This guppy has pink hair and a great singing voice. Hello. It's Molly! Which one of these leaves has the same sides that we need for our sail? This one, this one, or this one? This triangle has the right kinds of sides that we need. And so, they built their sailboat as fast as they could. Let's get out of here. Big, big monkey! monkey! Three big monkeys! Oh, we made it. And the wind's pushing our sailboat back toward home. What are we waiting for? This guppy is brave with a silly sense of humor. Cool! It's Gil! thought your cowlick was a couple of tasty worms. <laughs> Wave hello to our next friend. This guppy always sticks up for her friends and asks a lot of questions. Hello. It's Una. Let's go. My ocean. Whoa, 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 whoa. So the 
surfers surfed safely back to shore. Awesome wave, dude! Dudes! Oh, man! That was awesome! Will you teach me? Here, you can surf on our ice board. Awesome! Thanks! Dudes, look! So the surfers taught the polar bear how to surf, and they all surfed together for the rest of the awesome day. Awesome! Totally! It's time for another puzzle! This creative guppy loves to tell stories and has quite the imagination. Hello! It's Goby! We need more power! Watch the bubble tuggies. And repeat, watch the bubble tuggies. Gentlemen, the bubble of the sea has launched little mini tugboats to help push the ship. It's working! Ah! Aye, that was closer than a barnacle on a blue whale. Come on back, crew! We're heading out to sea! Sorry about dudes. Which swashbuckling guppy will appear when we line these tiles up? This guppy always sticks up for her friends and asks a lot of questions. Shiver me timbers, it's Una. PR, you'll never stop Windy Pete. Windy Pete. Never! Pirate Una, crank the snow cannon up to ten! Shiver their timbers! I said shiver their timbers! No, Captain. I'm not going to help you anymore. Una? It's time to stop your wintry ways, Windy Pete. Once and for all. Avast ye, another puzzle. This lad be a quiet guppy, and he's very smart. Yo ho ho, it's Nani. Arr! What did you get for lunch, Pirate Goby? Arr! I got a sandwich, tomato and cheese. What did you get, Pirate Uda? I got turkey and cheese. What did you get, Pirate Naughty? I got... macaroni and cheese. <laughs> 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 macaroni and cheese? That's silly! Let's solve another puzzle, me hearties. This guppy friend has quite an imagination and loves telling stories. It's Goby! Pirate hat, pirate coat, and for the feet, pink ballet slippers! Um... I don't think that pirates wear pink ballet slippers. No? I'd better check the computer. Pirate clothes, pirate clothes. Hey, you're right! They don't wear ballet slippers. Pirates wear boots. We need your help. Pirate boots have buckles. Which boots have buckles? These or these? Bells! Right! And my pirate likes lots of buckles. Which boots have the most buckles? These or these? Yeah, those boots have the most buckles. Perfect. Now he looks like a real pirate with real pirate boots. More puzzles, ye landlubbers. 
This friend sings shanties and is a natural-born captain. Ahoy! It's Molly. Look out! Excuse me, sir. Why do you keep chasing us? Well, I've never met pirates before, so I was wondering, will you take a picture with me? Of course we will. Would you like to have a picnic with us? Yeah, I've never been to a pirate picnic before. Yay! So the pirates and the white whale went back up to Picnic Peak for a picnic. And they all took a picture together. Okay, ready? Say R. R. And they all lived happily ever after. Let's play again, me scallywags. He's a brave cuppy with a silly sense of humor. Har har, it be Gil. Round and round the wheel goes, and where she'll stop, nobody knows. Arr, an eye patch. Let's look at the map again. We're here, at the wheel. Do you see the eye patch? There it is. Are the eye patches near or far from here? Far! Yeah, they're way over there. That's far. Let's go find them in the store. Look, they're back there. And here they are. Arr! Now you look like a proper pirate for sure. Looking good. Thanks, matey. And thank you for your help. Arr! Hey, check it out. It's a brand new puzzle to solve. Can you guess which fantastic friend this is? It's Gil! Try Sarah Cops. Cops are police officers. <laughs> Don't cry, dinosaur. We'll help you out of there. You will? Of course we will. Now please watch your speed, sir. Why were you going so fast? Well, I got new sneakers, and now I can run really fast. Maybe it was too fast. When you go too fast, it's not safe for you or for anybody else. And it's against the law. Just stay within the speed limit next time. The numbers on these signs will tell you. Thank you, officers. You're welcome. So the T-Rex learned to slow down, and they all lived happily ever after. Swimsational, another puzzle. This guppy has glasses and always has the silliest lunch in his lunchbox. It's Nani. Help us put the dinosaurs in the right groups. This dinosaur has big jaws, so it should go in the digging group. And this one has a big head, so it should go in the pushing group. Does this dinosaur belong in the digging group or the pushing group? Digging! The digging group! Yes, the digging group. Which group does this dinosaur belong in? Pushing! The pushing group! Right, the pushing group. Last one. Which group does this one belong in? Digging or pushing? Digging! The digging group, right. Our constructors are all in the right groups. Now we can finish the swimming pool. What are you waiting for? It's another puzzle. This undersea pup never strays too far from his best friend, Gil. It's Bubble Puppy! Uh-oh. Oh. Boom's down one level. All Bubble Puppy Source has got to do now is hit the buzzer and he'll be the winner. And he's... Casting the buzzer? <gasps> What's this? Bubble Puppy Saurus is going back down Volcano Mountain? <laughs> Look at this! Bubble Puppy Saurus is giving Boom Boom water! Aww. Have you ever seen anything like this? This is a 
a free history first. They're coming to the buzzer together! Oh, well, would you look at that? Wave hello to the next guppy. This guppy has purple hair and is good friends with Nani. It's Una. Okay, let's get these back to the saber tooth tiger. <laughs> Phew, we made it, and we have our windows. Let's add them to our cave. Our windows look great. <laughs> he looks cold. Aww. Poor thing. Excuse me, Mr. Sabretooth Tiger. Are you cold? <laughs> Mm-hmm. We just made a really nice home in this cave. Would you like to come inside? Mm-hmm. Yay! All right! And so, the saber-toothed tiger moved into the cave people's new home. Thanks to these windows, our cave is nice and bright. <coughs> That's just what our new home needed. A pet. It's time for another puzzle. This creative guppy likes to tell stories and use silly voices. It's Guppy! Looks like we lost them. That was a close one. But we still have to get past them to get to the cave stage to put on our play. But how? We are actors, right? Right? So, if we can act like mastodons, we might fool the real mastodons. Then we can walk right past them without getting stopped. Ready? Swing your arm back and forth like a mastodon. Hey, look, some new mastodons. It's working. Keep doing it. Hi, neighbors. Nice day to hang out, eh? Now make the mastodon sound. They seem nice. It worked! They thought we were mastodons. <laughs> That's because we're really good actors. You can ask your parents to subscribe to Nick Jr.'s Bubble Guppies YouTube channel for new videos every week. And watch full episodes on the Nickelodeon and Nick Jr. channel.